Hey, what's up going on guys? This is Kodiak Outdoors. Today, I'll be doing a review on this cheap little safety lock camping saw that I bought on Amazon for about $8. And, yeah. So, let's hop right into it. Let's open this package. First thing I notice is, well, it is from Amazon, so it is going to have some pretty cheap packaging. That's expected. But yeah, other than that, it comes out pretty easy. Um, first thing I notice here is it's here's something rattling when I shake it. But I don't know what it is, but first thing I notice about it is the grip on it, it's made out of rubber. And it is actually pretty good. Feels pretty good on your hands. And then right here, as you can see, you just push in this button. That's what allows you to pull out the um, blade. Now, holy cow. The first thing, well, not the first thing, but something I notice right away is it is it's pretty hard to get this out and it shakes. So the real question is, was this worth my money or not? Should I bought a different one? I'm gonna say, probably could have bought a different one. Because, it's not the best material as you can see here. It shouldn't be rattling like that. It shouldn't be so hard to push in. Like, holy cow guys. It's too much. And, uh, yeah, so this probably is not worth the money, guys. Um, it's got a screw thing here, which I think allows you to loosen it a little bit, but it's a pain in the butt to get in, but once it's in, it just rattles. It's not supposed to be doing that. So, I wouldn't suggest buying this off of Amazon, guys. I'd suggest going with something else. Um, it's a five inch carbon steel blade, so the blade itself is pretty good. That itself is pretty good, but the way they put it together is not so good. <coughs> like, I mean, just look at how hard this is for me. But, and then I'm put it out. Well, I guess it kind of wears in a little bit, it's starting to get a little easier. But, still, I'm not sure if it was exactly worth the money. Um, I mean, I guess it wasn't that much money. It just needs to get worn in a little bit. So, uh, yeah, that's basically the review about this. Um, it's also got a specially designed teeth on the blade. So... It claims that these are specially designed teeth. So, yeah. Um, it says it's got an ergonomic handle, so it helps reduce fatigue. Um, yeah, like I said earlier, it's got the rubberized grip and everything, and um. While the blade is open, it is about ten and a half inches long, but with it closed, it is what six and one fourth inches. But yeah, that's pretty much been the review about this, guys. This won't be all though. I'll be doing, I'll be adding in us cutting down trees and that with this, like testing it and everything. But I'll make sure to. Um, well, I might do a whole separate review. This is just like my opinion review about how I believe this is like my in uh, my opinion, my input on this. I mean, I like the whole idea of it, but the way it's set up isn't the best. It's okay though. Yeah. I definitely use this, guys. I'm not sure if you guys would. 
I don't advise it. I advise you to get a different one, but I'll def I definitely use this one. Um, but this will be part one of the review about the safety lock camping saw off of Amazon. And, yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Holy cow. See you guys? Oh. Um, <laughs> make sure to like and subscribe. And, pretty soon I'll be giving, be doing a giveaway. Um, like such as a camping saw like this, but a better quality one. Like, just throw in some comments telling me what you think I should give a giveaway on. But, I'll be giving a giveaway after we hit about 10 subscribers. That'll be our goal, is 10 subscribers. A like goal for this video will be 10 likes. And, yeah. So that's this, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. This is Kodiak Outdoors. And remember, when you were in the woods, you were never alone. Peace out.